Hello everybody, it's Shazid Kemal and working with the collaboration of Mr. Larry, we are learning the bootstrap tutorials essentials from basic to advanced. What you will be learning in this course is actually download and install the jQuery and the bootstrap. jQuery is necessary for some parts of the bootstrap because the bootstrap has a library of the uh, of the JavaScript which works by the jQuery support by the way. So what more we'll learn in this course? We'll learn the bootstrap word system which is really really necessary to create the web page with some easy techniques. Actually you just don't need to be careful about the width and the height and the margin and etc about the dimension of the page because all these things will be covered by the bootstrap using the its grid system so we'll be learning the bootstrap grid system the bootstrap has a lot of text tiles and the glyph icons what is a glyph icon is actually you can apply different kind of icons by using the font actually iconic fonts so we are just using the glyph icon which is actually the free package uh, the free package which includes in the bootstrap when we just download the bootstrap freely but if you just want to buy the glyph icon so you have to pay a big amount to buying this bootstrap header and navigation has really interesting features there are a lot of uh, header elements for the bootstrap like jumbotron like page header and etc but the navigation actually has uh, a complete package to create a navigation include its button include the logo include the side area and etc okay the bootstrap form elements this is really important class to learn the bootstrap completely because the form is really important element bootstrap can be applied on the inputs on the select elements on the data list elements on the text areas and etc and the buttons as well okay and bootstrap models and the panels what is the model actually this is just like the lightbox plugin which comes when just when we just click on the button or any kind of uh, header or any kind of a tag then it comes by using the fading technique so it needs the jquery library without jquery it won't run and then the panels the panel actually you can create and separate anything of the website inside any inside panel so you will learn some more things about the panels in the class later on different more bootstrap elements and classes you will be learning in this course which we can't describe on the introduction because this can be really big if I just describe all of them by the way we have some projects in the course as well a complete blog with the latest design you will really really like that design if you just work to create a blog so a complete photo gallery which is really necessary because most of the websites has a gallery nowadays and the complete inventory application so what is this the inventory application is actually some kind of uh, store management software which is uh, which is actually really important when we just working with the J uh, with the PHP but here we're just creating the theme for the inventory this is not the simple inventory you can suppose the inventory as the admin panel as the dashboard because the inventory has a dashboard inventory application has a product area of multiple forms and etc you will love this project so why you are too late to take this course let's just take this course by clicking on take this course button and let's enjoy we will see you in the course next after that goodbye